yo, hey yo. Ugh. I'll put it up a little bit. Hey yo, hey yo. Hey yo. Hey yo. All right, anyway, so what's up, y'all? Um, we might even potentially finish this today. This is piece two of my Vulture uh, art series here. So uh, last week I finished up my first piece and now we're gonna continue working on my second one that I started yesterday. So we made a lot of progress in just a few hours. And what we still need to do, I don't know if I left it to do or not, I did. So uh, we have to do shadows and highlights. We have to do a couple gradients. Um, and then we're gonna do blur shadows, which I don't know if there's a better name for, but I'm gonna do those. But I'm also going to draw a few things here first before I do any of this other stuff. So let's just go to uh, the background here. So let's, for now, just draw it behind the background layer. We're drawn with a 15 pixel brush, brother. Um, actually, we're not, we're gonna draw it over the to-do layer, but then we're gonna drag it down into the background layer. Yeah, we'll just do that. Just do this actually. Darn it, dude. What's going on? I'm just gonna erase all this. Because nothing wants to work properly, brother. I need a hotkey for skipping these songs. Some of these are pretty, pretty bad, y'all. Hate to be the bearer of bad news. anyway so just enough to know what it is I guess uh, far BG bushes and we might as well add these to this layer as well and then drag all that down into the background layer background folder layer folder or whatever
we're just gonna make this a little lighter off rip. We might do the same for the trunk colors are just colored. around these edges they're very hard to see the thin line here you don't want to miss nothing all right let me make this a little lighter because it's a little further in the distance that's the rule y'all I don't make the rules but I follow them So we're gonna bring all this down here. Bring it right there, let's go back to the to-do. And then we're gonna erase all this and erase this. So we're getting there, we're getting there folks. We're getting there folks. Erase this. Now we're gonna do all this other stuff we didn't draw yet. A little extra detail, you feel me? Like I was wondering what was going on there, brother. All right, let's get um. Just put the extra details. Put it all the way down. Here now, yeah, that works. Which means we 
can start shadows and highlights, y'all. What if we make the background sort of like a real pale yellow green color? We just do this for a second. Definitely more pale than that. Um, if I do something like that. I like that. It sets a it sets a tone, you know. It's establishes a mood. I'm gonna delete these two because we don't need those no more. Um, we'll name that sky. I'm skipping this off route. Um, ooh, actually, no, I forgot. We also need to. this real quick so we were gonna add some vines and stuff so I apologize for forgetting that let's um let's just make these orange or I mean <laughs> orange let's just make these pink so we can see them and then just merge that down and then let's continue drawing because I feel like we should add a little more than just that we could add like just trying to think of what I what I could do here I also need to edit this a little bit make it kind of go over The thing is, we um, we moved the shroom knight up a little bit, so now these don't really they don't match where he is. Keep uh, hitting the wrong keys, dude. What else is cool about uh, me doing this is I'm kind of getting ideas um, on like st stuff that kind of make these characters uh, unique. So <clears throat> basically I kind of uh, wanted him to kind of just be chilling in a bush because he let's say lives here. Um, but I think it, it could be like a cool like quirk for him to maybe like, I don't know, meditate like once a day in the bush, <laughs> something like that. I don't know. I'm just thinking about it now since I'm making art for him and I want him to be a pretty important character in the series. feel about these vines honestly guys I feel like they don't really make sense in a bush but I could add some more um, foreground kind of stuff a little uh I 
don't know if I, I don't think I should put that in front of him either. I want him to kind of like, I want it to kind of look like he's like, almost claustrophobic, you know, like he's almost kind of sealed off. I'm gonna fix this. This is bothering me. I don't know about other artists, but I'm very indecisive sometimes when I'm making art. Something I've uh, realized when um, painting is that it's really easy to mess up when you're painting. Which I, I rarely do physical art, but Painting is like one of those things where you consistently mess up and you just keep trying to fix it and fix it and fix it and fix it and try new things and um, so I don't know if uh, many other artists kind of feel that way about digital art <clears throat> but I also kind of run into those kind of issues just in a different way because it's more indecisiveness than anything not really uh, messing up. I guess I could do that kind of like individual branches kind of with no leaves kind of poking out kind of thing. I just kind of want to fill out like the foreground and kind of have some things kind of depth to this but I just don't think anything I'm doing really looks good I feel like these sticks are kind of kind of nice but the goal is to to make bangers you know so I don't want to make some you know filler kind of thing try we'll try this out we'll we'll sketch this or we'll uh refine this here and or ink honestly the line work on all these looks pretty good i might just keep this as the final
things work. All right, so this is what I'm gonna do. some work still so we're gonna fix this Okay, I'd like to say that one's not good. This one might need a little work. I think I'm just gonna redraw this one, honestly. Beautiful, all right. Look how, look how sloppy I am. I just get so mad once I like miss one key. I just keep it, keep it going, dude. Sorry, I lose my ability to talk sometimes when I notice something and I notice another thing and I gotta keep fixing stuff. Um, but. Anyway, um, coloring these branches here real quick. So we should have, yeah, four total. I need to fix that one all the way on the right. I think that was in the back of my mind as well. So 
Actually, I just forgot to merge those to make it all one layer. name this tall grass color I guess we'll just color it this color for mm. we'll make it this uh, lighter green color for now what am I seeing right now dude no way <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. Oh no. Something terrible has happened, y'all. Alright, so we've run into an issue. Let me just hide this for now. So this layer right here, um, at some point, and I hope this didn't happen earlier as well. This is slightly transparent. That is not a complete black right there. So that's not sick. Um, now let's see if it's everything. It's that one. This one's good. So that's that's good. Uh, I think this one should be good too. Then yeah. So it's just. See, I know, I know what happened. I remember now. So it was because before, um, I had made that sketch layer slightly transparent. Um, let's let's just hit an undo spree here real quick. See how far I can go. I might have to recolor these branches and everything. It might be worth it because drawing is more difficult than coloring. Okay, so it looks like we've reached our limit. So we are going to have to probably redraw these things. Let me, will I, uh, let me to just redo everything that I just undoed. Now we're at a good spot. So 
so first things first, what we're going to do is we're going to grab all of these that are somewhat transparent. I think this one is as well. Uh, maybe not. Maybe it's just this one. like barely see um you can see a little okay let's just make sure once again that this Okay, I thought I made a separate layer and I was drawing on that separate layer, but I wasn't. So yeah, transparent. in the back of my mind I know a workaround uh, actually I do I think I do so we're gonna uh, hit select all then we're gonna hit the V key we're gonna go down and up so it selects everything that we want it to and this should be good so we're just gonna select black and we're gonna color all of this in And I think that should be all right. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Ice cream so good. Yes, yes, yes. All right, we should be back on track, ready? back down I, think I forgot to do that before or maybe it was just a uh, lagging or something a little delayed
All right, so then what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna separate these uh, new pieces of grass I just drew. So I can move these independent from the branches. And I think I just want to try moving them around because they're blocking like some of the new stuff that I drew. Like this little piece of grass right here and stuff. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying things out though. right here I'm gonna kind of just add that little line there I don't really think it was supposed to have that line there but just for the sake of how it looks with that in front of it it kind of just makes more sense I can almost do the same right right there just to make that look like uh, one complete line And uh, so now I think I can do some shadows and highlights and gradients and stuff like that. Um, I think off rip we should do I think we should do the blurs first, the blurs and the gradients first actually because that could kind of give us some insight on how we should do shadows and highlights. And or uh, no, we, we should definitely still do shadows and highlights, but it will make it um, a little easier. So let's start with this ground here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take this color right here. Make that darker for the shadows. Um, we could do like, we'll, we'll do like a regular basic shadow layer. I guess I'm gonna just fix that up. Something like that.
All right, so let's just label this shadows. Um, and then, so what I want to do is I'm going to get an even darker color. Um, we could do, yeah, we'll do, we'll do it in shadows. So this is something that I very rarely do. Um, but for situations like this, I think it's pretty cool. Basically, I'm um, changing my brush. Um, I don't remember. The one I typically use for this though, and you can't really see my window here. I don't know why it doesn't show uh, windows like this. Is this it? Oh, this is it. All right, so what I have right here is I have uh, this sort of like leaf kind of shape, and I think this works really well for what I'm trying to do here. So um, what we did is we made another shadows layer, and we're gonna kind of just uh, And we'll, we'll rock with it. Let me uh, create these into clipping masks. Now, as you see, it looks a little weird. Like, that doesn't really look like it fits the vibe. It looks kind of corny and generic. Um. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to a filter at the top. We're going to go to blur and then Gaussian blur. And then we can kind of choose how much blur we want to add. And now, as you can see, it's a little different. It's a little cooler. Um, I'm just trying some things out here. Might just take away if we do this. this an even darker color something like that It might honestly just look better like that. And then we could do highlights over that, possibly. We'll see how that works. It might not work, look that great. But we'll uh, throw this back on. Same this uh, shadow blur. Go back to our main brush here. And try to add some highlights. I feel like that looks all right. Maybe I'll, <laughs> did I draw it on the wrong layer? I did. Hey. 
This is what being an artist is all about. Just consistently fucking up. But. Fuck it, we ball. You heard? You heard me? So what I wanted to do was I wanted to lower the opacity a little bit. So it kind of uh, blends in with this pattern here. And I feel like that looks pretty good. Um, however, we could also release clipping mask here and we could add like a gradient. Um, that is not showing anything. All right, let's do like pure black gradient. Clipping mask. <laughs> Why do I keep doing this? Keep drawing on the wrong layer. So now that this uh, gradient here is uh, kind of linked to um, these highlights, then we could choose like how dark some of them get. I don't think black was the right move though, to be honest. Maybe I should like... Just do lighten, honestly. I don't know if that even does anything. <laughs> it looks like it doesn't. Okay, yeah, we're not even gonna worry about it. It looks good like this. Um, and I'm actually just gonna relink this because I saw that it was kind of clipping over this edge here, but we're good. So that should be all right. Now let's get this uh, other brush out again here. Bring the spacing up a little. Now we're gonna do some of the other stuff down here. So we're gonna do like this rock color here. that layer create clipping mask I can't talk I don't know why I should do a darker color not a lighter color it's a shadow for Christ's sake So we're gonna use that same amount of blur there. That looks beautiful, sick, awesome. Um, we could, we'll, we'll do all the little highlights and stuff after. So we can just keep using this brush and just keep it moving. So we can do the same thing to these. This color make it darker probably do a little uh
Yeah, I don't, I'm not gonna blur those because they're just so small. When you blur it, it just looks like it's not even, I didn't even do anything to it, it's just like darker. Can't really tell, so. Um, anyway, let's see you. So I think I'm going to turn the blur down a little bit. Let's see where we're at though. So we were rocking a 9.2. For this uh, specific one, we're going to go down to a 3.7. Just makes more sense. Alright, I'm gonna try this out. I don't know if this is gonna be a vibe or not. We're gonna do like all of this, and I think I'm just gonna. So let's just let's just see. Let's give it a go. Blur. Gaussian blur. Seems like it's it, it's good. Now we could do the same thing to these. So yeah, I think I think we got all the this layer down. Just missing a couple of these uh, far back ones. Dude, what is this? These are like not real chords. So I'm gonna make sure you do all these before. I think I got all of them at this point. Let's 
put a zoom in. background done now for shadow blurs got some of these all right I'm gonna hide our boy for a second I could have filled out this uh, this a little more but obviously it's not being shown so I guess it doesn't really matter too much but It's always a good idea to do that if you can. depend on what kind of uh, size this area is and like how I guess really how big um, this brush I'm using is because like for the ground I made it like this and here I made it like this but for this I made it a little bigger for these I made it a little smaller so just want to keep that in mind Okay, trunk color. That looks pretty good. All right, now before we do, um, the shadow blurs on these, I wanna add one other color to these uh, little leaf stems, I guess you would say. I think I'm gonna make those like this color. And I'm gonna have to go back and choose my other good brush for that. fix that as well we don't like that sloppy stuff Momentarily, once I do 
update this once again. So here's my order of operations. I'm gonna do the shadow blur on this. Small uh, thing that you probably will not even see. Um, I'm actually not even gonna blur it though. This is so small. Um, I'm gonna do the shadow blur on the leaves themselves. That's probably pretty good. And then I'm going to fix this weird little uh, thing right here. Sick. Sick, 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 sick. All right, yeah, I think we got everything in this uh, piece right here. Beautiful. Um, now all this stuff we can add to the FG2, the foreground, if you will. Let me do this, sh this grass here. that a little more that looks good do that no those I did get so we're gonna actually do something here because a couple of these look like they didn't really even give kind of this pattern here gotta kind of just lay it on a little lighter there and then let's redo the Gaussian blur okay let's uh, let's fix the amount of blur here too dial it back a little bit then we'll do the branch color All right, now that should be good. Now let's hide the foreground and then show the Shroom Knight. All right, we'll start with this white here. Now I'm not gonna do it to his eyes because I want the eyes to be very visible. I don't want there to be any real like interference there, I guess. do 
this light red. Trying to decide what uh what size to make a couple of these. So I feel like it helps if I actually lower the blur on these ones. And I could also lower the brightness a little bit, make it stand out. So easy to uh, it's so easy to make like a huge jump between not enough blur and too much blur, like by a lot. But it's also very like Each each time you go up and down on the blur like incrementally with the arrow keys, it doesn't do anything. So you gotta go up like ten times to see a difference. Kinda goofy. But yeah, I forgot how I did all these differently. Um, so we're definitely gonna use the same amount of blur for each of these.
you might notice that uh, this is fucked up. And I'm just leaving it. <laughs> it's not gonna show. I guess I could get rid of that little dot there. That's like really unneeded, unnecessary. So anyway, let's do his torso color here. good fingies I never did that one this one I might not even need to blur but we'll see I think I should at least a little bit something like this and since it's so such a small area maybe I'll bring the brightness down just a tad all right I think we got the torso down I'm just gonna look around and see if there's any area we missed not the eyes Yeah, just the legs here. So we'll start with this. see if I can find a middle ground without having to fuck around because I didn't realize that this and this were part of the same layer um, I r realized they were part of the same they were the same color yeah I think this is good because I didn't want to over blur this one while blurring this part but I didn't color that in before so same thing with this huh um I did all, I did the legs already, I'm tripping. Sorry for my ignorance. Just didn't appear that way, but maybe I should um let's bring the con uh, contrast up a little bit, maybe. Do 
something like that. That's cool. All right. Um, this inner color here. I don't really think this makes much sense to do the shadow blur on, but we're going to do it anyway. See what it looks like. Makes more sense to just do regular shadows for that, but. We'll just do that. It's not really going to make too much of a difference. Okay. Now let's add the foreground again. So we got a nice little, uh, we got a nice little piece here. And we did all the shadow blurs, which means we can go back to our to-do here. Um, I don't think we're going to end up doing the vines. I just think that's overkill. Kind of messy. I don't want it to look like he's trapped or anything, so I think we're good on that. Uh, let's do, let's get shadow blurs out of here. Blur shadows. Now in terms of gradients, I wasn't really gonna do much for gradients anyway. So maybe we just do this real quick. I wanted to kind of just do this uh, floor here a little bit. Just adds a little bit of depth, nothing crazy. Um, just name this gradient for now. Alright, I think it's just shadows and highlights for now, boys. Ugh. Oh man, making progress though. So let's um let's save this. As Shroom Knife 4. Ah, I forgot to hide this layer, silly me. Real quick to my to-do, I think I'm gonna also add, um, let me, let me get back on my good brush here. Well, that, we might add a little bit of fog effects in the far background. I don't feel like doing it just yet. I wanna do it as kind of like a final touch kind of thing. But let's start with, uh, whoops. Making a highlights layer, copying it, okay. So each time, we do this, we're gonna need to hide the shadow blur for a second to get the color so that we can add highlights to it. And I'm also noticing that there's a small, Gap there. There we go.
let's put the uh, highlights above this. At least for now, so I can see it. I think we might uh, end up doing a little uh, semi transparent highlights kind of thing. And I also got to fix this. So obviously, something went a little. Uh, a little goofy back when we had to fix the layer for this. But we want to make it right. trying some things out to kind of plan out what we're going to do for the rest of this. I don't think... Yeah, if we just do shadows traditionally, I think that's the best way kind of just add it to these layers um the problem is that because i'm making the highlights uh semi-transparent we can't draw the shadows into the highlights or we're gonna get left with stuff like that and it looks like shit so we gotta be kind of careful about that Now, in retrospect, should I have done the shadows like after, like the shadow blurs after I did the highlights and regular shadows? Maybe. Because I'm going to have to hide it each time that I want to get the color for the highlights and shadows. Sorry. I can't. You can't hear me over these fucking wubs, dude.
Uh... <coughs> I'm not gonna do highlights for these. They're pretty much all gonna be in shadows, I'm pretty sure, so. Um, these are the same color. I forgot about that. So let's see, I gotta do these uh, stems here. These are the leaves, not the stems. I'm tripping. It's bothering me too. I do recall saying the leaves were going to be a pain in the ass. So far they are living up to those expectations. Okay, we got those ones good. to fix those lines too man what's going on here some of these lines are just straight up horrendous all right hold the phone we got some things to fix here that a little smoother there
then we gotta put that back down to 60 and then let's fix up some of these lines here because some of these are busted too I think part of it is that I have a uh, sort of like beginner level tablet and so just in general the pen strokes aren't as smooth and they kind of wiggle around so I think that might be part of it Taking down booking. Good. Looks pretty good. Oh, what am I doing? Ah, guys, I keep drawing on the wrong layers, dude. God, that's so annoying. <laughs> and then I went back too far and then I accidentally pasted and now I gotta redo these lines that I just fixed guys I'm a mess today I'm a mess I'm sorry y'all I'm sorry I let y'all down. I 
I should be alright now. Anyway. Now we have a highlights layer. We have a highlights color. Let's do this again. Put this down to 60, see what it looks like. Um, I can honestly probably go down to like 40. That blur needs to be. down a little bit okay that's that bushes color all right I'm gonna hide um all that so I can actually see the bushes because I do want to get the highlights properly done on here Good. What's that? What is that?
You're doing bushes and shit. I think that's good. Beautiful. Alright, let's bring it down to like 50. It's pretty solid. Fuck it. Um. down to like 60 maybe holy 
270. Oh, man. Just do like a little, uh, that looks good. Um, I don't really think I need to bring down the highlights down too much. Maybe I'll just put it to like 80. That looks good. Okay, so we should have the foreground and, well, not the background. We have uh, the foreground done. For highlights, we still gotta do all the shadows too. Do the background highlights, I guess. Shouldn't be take too long. Uh, I'm not gonna go crazy with the highlights for um, all of these like bush leaves or whatever because that's gonna take forever. Um, I will do a little bit though, but I'm not gonna do like every little crevice gonna take forever and then half of it you're not even gonna see anyway so Probably gonna take a little bit of time though, y'all. Ain't gonna lie, but
do. We're just gonna clean up all this shit. Something like that. Follow through right here. Maybe something like that. Just make it easy. Whoops. I think that's pretty good, honestly. Maybe do this. Maybe like a couple right here and down below some. These will be like real minuscule anyway because they're a little further away from the light source here.
some of that. I feel like that's pretty good. Beautiful. Honestly, I don't know if I'm going to bring this down at all. Let's bring it down a little bit. I kind of like it nice and bright like that, to be honest. Um, and honestly, we probably should do all of this down here. Because there's a light, so a pretty big light source right there. I think it's only right. Um, it's honestly probably pretty good. Maybe just add a couple more little uh, streaks of light here, right here. Whoops. I think that looks good. And we'll just keep it bright for now. We might change it when we look at everything together, but I think for now it's fine. Oh man, I feel like I've been streaming a lot longer than I have been. But I guess, you know, two hours. Still a pretty decent amount of time. Especially since I'm not doing like, I don't do like react content or anything. Let's 
360 is good. And then, yeah, the ground is alright. Now we do these. <laughs> Guys, I'm doing it again. How am I doing this so frequently? Okay. I could have sworn I made a highlights layer. Why am I like this? Okay, and then we also, I, I noticed a small thing right here. So we're just going to... Back to highlights. I'm glad I noticed it before getting uh, too far here. Aside from today, I haven't really been drawn on the wrong layer a lot. I feel like I've made like a lot of mistakes today for whatever reason. Like it's been a while for me. Like, and I've been I've been doing a lot of art like behind the scenes, like um, not on stream basically. And I still like that doesn't happen to me as much as it used to anymore. I feel like I've been pretty good about that, but today has just been crazy. are in like the same uh or in different playlists the same songs are in the in different playlists a lot of them pretty mid color this one is pretty
pretty unnecessary, but we're gonna do it anyway. So small, you can barely tell the difference otherwise. Okay, so I think I got the foreground and the background. I might have, uh, I didn't do this yet, so. Oh, okay, so it's these ones. All right, I see. Let's do this, do this. Shadow blur for these ones, unfortunately. I don't think. Or did I? Oh, I did. Never mind. Maybe I should, uh. Turn the brightness down on them a little bit so you can see them a little more. Now we got to do the the main the main boy. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna turn these um, highlights down to like maybe like 80 or something, maybe even like 70, 60. All right, we'll put it at 60 for now. What about these ones? These ones I'm also gonna like put at like 60 or something. But yeah, now we can do this guy, this fucker's highlights. Oh man. should pretty much maybe I make them a little thicker that should pretty much be that and then we can just bring this down a little bit so it's not put it to like 50 It's just, it must just be the contrast. Cause it kind of seemed like for a second there, the uh, 
color wasn't very visible. But like over here, it's much more visible, so. Do something like that, maybe put it down to like 80. It's probably pretty solid. Now, honestly, this black color, I think I'm gonna actually put the brightness down a little bit. add any brightness to it I don't eh, we could add a little bit or, uh, I meant to say highlights not brightness sorry so we'll take this and then we'll grab just real quick uh, little lines on the sides there Or we could do something a little cooler and we could do a gradient. And add it over that. And then bring this back a little bit. I think that looks pretty cool. Maybe bring it all the way down to like 30. So this is with it and this is without it. So just a, just a slight little uh, improvement. Okay, we got white, light red, black. Let's do the regular red now. Do this color. And then we'll just uh, follow the path here. Let me just fix that up a little bit. So do a little something like that, a little something like that. That looks pretty sick. Probably don't even need to make it transparent at all, to be honest. All right, let's do the little fingies. This beat is like if DJ Khalid made a song with Ski Mask. Like he got like a corny version of a Ski Mask type beat and then made him rap on it. Now let's bring this down to like 70. Or this is like a Justin Timberlake type beat. There's no in between. Okay, so let's see. No disrespect to JT or Ski Mask. Okay, we do something like that more. Then 
The song deserves all the disrespect, though. Shake that ass trap beat is what that song was called. Brother. Fuck. Okay, let's bring this down to like 80. Okay, let's bring this down to like 60. Okay, let's bring this down to like 40. Okay, let's put it up to like 50. All right, 50 it is. That's what we're rocking with. Which means I'm gonna put these hoes to 50. I'm sorry, I don't mean to shit on, like, royalty-free music, but, like, I don't know. Someone's got to be getting a bag for that, so I feel like, because otherwise, why make royalty-free music? I don't understand. You got to be getting some kind of bag from, like, Streamlabs or whoever. And it just seems like so, a lot of these are, like, so minimal effort, you know? Like, am I using it? Am I using them for my stream? Well, yeah, because, like, I can't. I can't play, like, Chief Keef, dude, because I'll get my channel deleted. But I would play Chief Keef, you know what I'm saying? They should have like a swamp music playlist, that's what I want to hear. pretty gooch dude um all right what if i do like a little bit of this nah we're good all right now i might as well do this one and pretty much that's just gonna be this this, this.
right, let's put this one down to like 70. Cool, let's put this one down to like 70. Now there is a little bit of a dilemma here, so first off, let's fix this, but there's also um, this that's sort of cutting that off, so I'm thinking we do something like that, and it kind of leans in from like the armpit. And just smooth that out. think that's pretty solid yay and maybe just kind of a uh, curve that a little bit um, then maybe bring this down to like 80 that looks pretty good okay some big highlights. So when you kind of just got to be conscientious of like the angle of the light source because it kind of twirls around. it has this curve here the light source kind of hits here but it doesn't hit the top of this as much but it hits this side and then it also hits down here so stuff like that is a little confusing sometimes and the light source being like mainly here obviously this should be a light source as well but it's all right not really considering it as much Realistically though, honestly, this would probably be like the main light source. Well, not exactly, because the actual light would be coming from here. This, there's no like sun down here, it'd probably be more up here, so. things uh, the viewer probably won't even think about though so do whatever you like do whatever you like you're the artist I'm trying to make that a little smoother that's good <laughs> I don't know if you guys hear that honking here. Let me. All right, now I think they're done. My street is pretty much just all year round honking, uh, ambulances, fucking 12. Firefighters fucking storming past my crib. 
potentially gunshots from time to time, you know, not too often, but here and there. Uh, earlier this summer, there was a car flip sideways. Not uncommon, not uncommon around these parts. But yeah. Type of shit, uh, my city be on. this person is is really concerned about the well-being of someone's stomach water intake this bitch is talking about water intake what is going on she's talking about extended lunch breaks and water intake and food on the table when you're hungry what the fuck is she talking about what are you yapping about brother sheesh what is this? Covering you like a record album sleeve. Don't hesitate. Slide in. Small scratches. Makes my heart skip. On repeat. Put me in rotation. Tune everyone else out. Headphones plugged in. Vibes and beats made simultaneously. I'm tangling. Bro, what is she talking about? Penetrating walls that are no longer soundproof. Now more than a mic check. Bro, if is this like of innuendo for sex? Cause this is like not this is not it, Chief. Turn the pages. New chapter. Let me show you now. Just put on Lost by Chance the Rapper. That's like that, but like a good song. Oh my god. I can't believe what I just heard, man. Alright, let's put this down to like 70. Alright, let's put this down to like 50. That's pretty solid. Okay, now we're gonna do. I gotta do that inner part, but that's there's no highlights there, so we're not gonna do that. This is pretty easy, just fucking boop and boop. Except one thing. That has to go with that waistline and connect here to those highlights and same thing here. Super chill, dude. Super chill. Put that down to 50. Like the other one. Oh shit, we gotta do this leaf too. How did I miss that?
Alright, that's solid. Um, honestly, let's put, um... Let's continue this little line right here. Add a small tinge of highlights right here. Very unnoticeable. Still did it. Alright, y'all. I think we're good on highlights. Let me just chill for a second. See, I was doing um, just a little bit of uh, backups today because um, my homie sold me a new PC that's better than the one I currently have. The one that I'm currently using. And so... Um, I wanted to back up all my stuff, and most of my stuff is backed on an external hard drive, but I also put some stuff in my Google Drive folder. Uh, real quick, let me let me save this before I get sidetracked here. So this is going to be another uh, progress pick here. And that will be Shroom Night 5, now that we have highlights. But anyway, I'm just making sure that all my stuff uplo uploaded to my Google Drive because I closed it before and I think everything uploaded. But I didn't really realize I closed. I think it's because I, uh, I had to restart my computer because something wasn't working. So I just got to make sure everything uploaded. Otherwise, it's going to be a pain. gonna chill in here till I figure that out I don't know if I'm gonna do shadows or not today page owner 
unresponsive. Come on, bro. I'm just trying to see how many items are selected. Hmm. All right. Yeah, that's a lot of items. I think it was waiting on like 50 items, man. Uh, sloppy. This is really annoying. All because I'm a silly goose. Should be 15 items, okay.
All right, well, because I have a bunch more stuff to upload, I think we're just gonna keep rolling and just uh, try to finish this right now. So we'll see, we'll see how far I get before I get burnt. Um, let's add a little gradient to the sky here, honestly. Ooh, I kind of like that. I didn't mean to um, have like a circular gradient here. It's kind of nice though. I think I might prefer it in this situation. A little more than the regular one that I use, so keep that in mind. So I think um, we're gonna do foreground first. Okay, so this one I already did shadows on because this is when I was testing things out. Got it. Why are these so, uh, actually I know why, cause they need to be, um, they need to be darker than the blurred shadow layer. So I have to, I have to make these shadows extra dark and I gotta keep that in mind. I got all the grass here. Let's bring that down to like 80. That looks pretty good. Okay, then right off the rip, we're gonna do um, this because it's the same color. Uh,
I'm gonna have to blow my nose soon, brother. I got allergies up in here. Brother. Oh man, my nose is like actually running right now. Uh, hold up, y'all. Golly gee. Gee Willikers. Gee Willikers, Batman. Oh man. <laughs> so weird. I haven't had allergies like at all this year. Uh, too cold in my room or anything. I mean, it's not great. But it could be worse. Alright, I think I put these down to like 80 before. Alright, anyway. Let's do, uh... What is this color? The... Yeah. Why is that not showing? Huh? too dark, but I guess not.
thinking probably 80 again for this. Might have to make it a little. No, that looks pretty good. I think that's good. And this one I know I gotta make pretty dark. And again, we're gonna hide this group so I can see the bushes better. shadows for this probably just kind of do a couple doing more than I should be doing, but I'm going to do it anyway. Because I'm a red-blooded American. I make sure I get my shit done. I make sure I do it the right way the first time so I don't got to come back. You hear me, Joe Brandon? solid honestly um, do a little work here and here and here that's solid okay I made it work I made it look good Thank you. 
something like that. Trying way too hard. Let's bring this down to like 60. That's pretty good. 50. 50 is probably more natural. Okay. Uh, what is this? Okay, that's what I thought it was. Grab this. Put this up here. Make this color very dark. Too dark in fact. A lot of these lo fi beats choose like the wackiest like vocal samples. Like, what the fuck is that? What are y'all talking about? What are y'all sampling? Y'all just find, like, some royalty-free shit to sample. And you're like, yeah, this is, this is good. Hell yeah. It's not too dark. Put it to like 90. Call it a day. Beautiful. Alright, now we gotta do this one. Something a little more like that. Bring this all up in here. Round this off a little bit. up a little bit. Just kind of round those corners a little bit. You feel me? Looks good to me. Fuck it. Maybe I'll just put it to like 90 so it kind of bleeds through a little bit. And I think we got the foreground done though. 
pretty solid. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make that folder green. All right, now we got to do shadows on here. Start right here, grass color, super simple. Um, I'm not even going to do that, honestly. Too simple, not worth it. the kind of music I fuck with the most because it's like it's jazzy it has rhythm it goes on for a while like but in a good way it doesn't just like fade out of nowhere and it's got phases and it just you know switches chord progressions slightly That was, a, that was a good one. Not everything needs a drill beat. Alright, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make this a little darker. So I feel like. I'm gonna do something like that. And then we're gonna bring it down to like 80. So it's gonna kind of cancel out anyway, but I feel like it's a vibe. All right, did I do these shadows? That's different. We'll get there. It's all the way down here, so. Scheme of things. I think it does look a little better, honestly. Yeah, we'll keep that. Hmm. Nice. Swag. Alright, let's get back to the fucking task at hand here. Now we gotta do these trunk, or this one singular trunk color, sorry. Right down to 80, that's cool. 
beautiful. Put it back up to 90. All right, now this is gonna be a little bit of a pain, I presume. sketching out my ideas here real quick and then I can maybe clean it up later. A little something like that. A little something like this. Just, I don't know if it's worth it to even do this. It's gonna take a while. I mean, we could just kind of fill out like, some whole patches like this. Is uh, it's gonna like take a while, and a lot of it's gonna be covered by the shroom night anyway. And I honestly don't know how good it will look anyway. Also, to do what I'm doing I don't know gotta try it out Thank you. 
chicken dance one. Okay, I think we do something like that. Does this beat not sound like the chicken dance, bro? Or some shit? Like. <laughs> sounds like a chicken, like, clucking or something. It's off beat, and I hate that. done with that. Should have been done with that for a minute, but I got a little sidetracked with uh, my backup shit. I'm still waiting for that to load. This one's pretty cool, but it's clipping pretty bad, and I don't like that. Why is it clipping?
way a little bit, maybe kind of lean in this way, you know, something like that, something like that, type vibe. Things are getting a little complicated over here, brother. good did I do way more than I needed to do absolutely but it looks fucking awesome so let's do one of these and then let's do Bring this down to like 80. See how that looks. If we just put that above there. That's silly. Alright, what if we brought the shadows down to like 
60. We'll do that. Sorry, just had to look at my phone for a second. Let me blow my nose real quick. Yeah. I hope that looks appealing to you. See me blow my nose. All right. Um, uh, home stretch, y'all. Home stretch. Home stretch. So. We got white. I'm just gonna select this darker gray color here. Um, in terms of shadows, so the shadows are gonna be sort of towards like the center here. Cause he's uh, standing directly in front of the light source, so it's gonna be something like. And then of course, not really doing his eyes, but we could sort of could sort of do sort of the shadow right here, this ridge, and then we're gonna bring this down to like forty, maybe, maybe even thirty, honestly. I think that's good. All right, now we gotta get this light red color. Yeah, see, I messed up. 
that's why. is really not popping through a lot so I'm gonna bring the lightness down a little bit then we're gonna bring the highlights down a little bit So for shadows, we can actually do a couple things here. One, we're gonna make one under this ridge here that goes along and follows uh, this sort of path, but we're gonna have to put it above here. Let me redo this though. So we wanna keep it in line with the shadows on the eyes here. So we could do it on the bottom as well. All right, now let's even add another shadow here. That's going to be sort of in line with uh, this uh, shadow we put right here. So it's going to kind of follow this way. And then we'll make the regular red color sort of fall in line with that as well.
make sure I didn't miss anything. Uh, looks like I didn't really quite get that properly. All right, now let's put this down to like 80 or something. 60. That works. Let's get this color once again. And now we're gonna follow this. That was pretty good. All right, we got the fucking head down, dude. Let's go to torso. Starting with the fingies. really raining out today cozy stream vibes guys it's a fucking cozy stream vibes dude I believe this is his shoulder. Yes. Okay, let's bring that down to like 80, 60, 60 is good.
something like that. Bring it down to 60. Beautiful, 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 bitch. All we gotta do is fucking weird little mushroom arms, dude. That's good, let's bring it down to like 80 probably. Mm, 70, this is a little thin right here. all these Let's Let's bring the shadows color down even though I don't understand why I would have to. 
It should be the same color as this, but I might have messed up at some point. We'll just do that. Um. Jesus. Alright, so this is what I'm thinking. I'm going to make this a little darker. And then bring it down to like 50. Bring it down to like 30. That looks good. Um one issue though I need to kind of draw these uh right all right uh things gotta be complicated for no reason what I do that and then yeah that's good okay so then I think I just need to do oh, I did miss something else good nice and easy All right let's do this on here real quick. What I'm doing right now is probably not necessary and probably not even going to what I'm going to end up doing. We'll see though. We'll see what's up. We'll see the vibe. Um, maybe if I make it like transparent enough, let's make it like 40 or something and then kind of just
bring this back up to like 60 maybe. It's pretty cool. Pretty swag. Pretty sick. Pretty sick, dude. around a lot let's see is there anything I missed so yeah I think it's just this and then I gotta do some shadows on the inner part there yeah I think it's just those two pieces shadows on this might be a little difficult we'll see I don't know where I was going with that. Uh, maybe we could do something like this. I feel like that's not really a vibe though. Maybe it is, I don't know. Nah, looks weird. something here will it matter not really i'm gonna do it anyway yeah bitch Shadows on those rocks, yeah, what's up with that? Four highlights. So 
stupid. <laughs> uh, Alright, hold up. Let's fix this first and foremost. Let's do some highlights as well. good Let's see what it's looking like guys I think we we did it off rip um I did mention that I was thinking about adding a little bit of uh, fog so let's try that Oops, let me get a let me actually get this color here why is this not dark man guys i think i did it oh, i'm dying oh, my legs are so tired from fucking sitting in one spot Now we could potentially add some little bugs. planning on kind of just hopping off but I'm still waiting for things to upload so maybe I'll just add these little dudes maybe some leaves falling or something I don't know that might not look as good cheat there that's disgusting guys fuck all right so i'm thinking 
real quick. Let's draw some little guys. Obviously that's not symmetrical, but it kind of makes sense for them flying around and stuff, so maybe... Maybe that ain't bad. Okay, this will be like the little back. Let me draw these first, actually. So it looks pretty good, except I think I want this line to go in a little deeper. To add depth, baby. That's what I'm talking about, depth. Do that like little... Mm, what should I do right here? Yeah, we'll just do some lines like that. <laughs> My hearing. This is like the same beat that was playing before with the little baby crying or whatever. Just like in the opposite order or something. That looks pretty good. guys like that um, hide this for now and then let's okay I don't need these moths now I'm gonna draw their little uh, hands and or mouths
trying to see how I could uh, draw their mouths, maybe give them a couple little uh, mandible kind of things right there. I don't know. Trying to make the, the legs look all bug-like. Maybe too long, but kind of the right vibe. Dude, I have no clue why I have so much allergies today. Jesus Christ. I don't even think I've been outside. Alright, let's do... I guess I could just draw them like that, if that makes sense. Just plain and simple. Don't gotta be too complicated or nothing, you know?
symbolic grasshoppers. their entire uh, color with one single color. For the time being. this shit finished and I know I can do it I mean technically I already finished what I thought I was gonna do but I'm adding more stuff because I really want it to look cool I am making it so complicated for myself Actually gonna make this color even darker. All right, let's do the eye color right away. Let's figure that out. Um, let's choose a color like this actually.
Triple do this as simply as possible. Golly G. I don't know how I feel about this little guy over here. on all of them so that's going to be this one color and the antennas I don't know if it's really even worth it to do the eye color, but we're going to do it anyway. I'm going to have to fix the size of that little dude's eye, because I think that's why it looks kind of fucked.
I did those. <laughs> Yeah, I think so. I think that's better. Two more of those. Just fix that up a little bit. Alright, let's make some more fog. Wanna try something? Now let's put 
this behind the Shroom Knight. That definitely adds some shit. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Alright, now... Let's... Let's copy this layer. Let's put one above the Shroom Knight. And then let's get a gradient going. in here should I do darken oh uh, screen I should do screen and then just kind of dial it back a whole lot that honestly looks pretty sick no cap brother <laughs> no cap brother Sheesh. All right, y'all. I think I think that's it. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. y'all well thanks to everyone who tuned in i appreciate you as always um we are done with piece two so i'm going to once again save this post editing on my phone at watermarks and uh we will see this posted on my instagram in a few weeks so again thank you guys bye